and welcome to day number two of this low impact workout for beginners. It's all going to be standing as well. Um, we're going to be doing some standing abs today. So everything is going to be standing. You will need a pair of dumbbells. If you don't have a pair of dumbbells, just grab yourself some tins of food or some bottles of water because it's still going to work exactly the same way. So we're going to do a lot of it standing. There's a couple that we're going to do without the uh dumbbells and then there's a couple we're going to do with the dumbbells so everything's all going to be standing it's going to be hitting the abs okay so there's going to be six exercises in total so there's going to be 40 seconds of work and we're going to have that 20 second breather where i'll then explain the next exercise for you as well uh, make sure you hit that like button that subscribe button down there so you can be notified every time that i post up a video at the same time all right get yourself a warm-up done and i'll see you in a minute ready here we go so all you're going to need for the first one you don't need your dumbbells for the first one the first one we're going to do is elbow to knee. So we're gonna come in off of that opposite side, okay? So it's gonna hit your ab area. Ready? We're gonna go in five, four, three, two, one, and go. There we go. So we're gonna do 40 seconds of work with that 20 second rest. There we go, just keep it going. Everything's standing, there's no jumping around, nothing like that, okay? So you can repeat this seven days as many times as you like which will help you build up that fitness level. They're all gonna be about 10, 15 minutes long. That's it. If you can challenge yourself each time with different sized dumbbells, go ahead. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. Okay, so the next one we're gonna do is a two pump knee strike. So hands are gonna come up, we're gonna come in. So it's one, Two, we're then gonna swap other side. One, two, okay? Ready, we're gonna go in five seconds, ready? Here we go, in three, two, one, and go. One, two, swap sides, one, two. And again, swap sides, one, two, swap sides, one, two, that's it. Just keep swapping sides around. That's it, just keep going. And again, that's it. We're going to need the dumbbells in a minute for the next exercise. That's it. Well done. 10 more seconds for me. And again. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest it up. Okay, so we've got hook into a knee. Okay, so it's going to be opposite knee, opposite hook. So it should look like this. Okay, so we're bringing the knee and those hooks into play as well. Ready, here we go. Ready, in five, four, three, two, one, and go. That's it. Target that ab area. Let's try and hit the whole core for you. That's it, well done. So after we've done this side, we're gonna repeat and go on the other side. That's it. Keep going. 15 seconds left. Well done. Last 10. That's it. Well done. Just keep going. Keep pushing these out. Three, two, one, and rest it off. So we're going to do the same thing. Other side. So it's going to be opposite knee, opposite hook. So it should look like that. Ready? We're going to go in 10 seconds for you. Ready? Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one, and go. Set. Well done. So we've got two more to do, and then we're going to repeat the circuit. Set. Well done. We're going to do some side lifts next with the dumbbells as well. That's it, well done, keep going. 15 seconds for me. That's it, we're nearly there, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, you're gonna have your dumbbell or you can use a kettlebell, it's absolutely fine. If you don't have one, it's fine, just do it without. Feet shoulder width apart. One hand's gonna come up, hold your temple. All we're gonna do is we're just gonna come down as far as you can go, 
and then come straight back up. Okay, taking your time. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. That's it, well done. Just go as far as you can go with it. Keep going. Well done. And like I said, everything is standing. So we're not getting on the floor once for any of these. That's it, well done. Keep going. Last 10 seconds. So we're gonna do the same thing, other side. Ready? In five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. Okay, so swap hands. Remember, we're coming up, fingers on the temple. I know what we're gonna do. So we're gonna come down as far as you can go and then come straight back up for me. You're gonna take your time, okay? Just gonna control that tempo for me. Ready? Here we go. In five, three, two, one. Let's go. Let's blast these out. That's it. Well done. So again, you don't need to use the weights. Just do this without the weights if you want. Or if you've got the weights, use the weights. If you've got a kettlebell, use a kettlebell. If you don't have that, you can just get yourself a rucksack as well. Uh, just hold the rucksack out in your hand. Exactly this way. And fill it up with something. And it'll still work. That's it. Well done. Keep going. That's it. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. Right, put your dumbbells down. Okay, so now we're going to repeat the circuit, okay? So it's going to be elbow to knee, okay? So all we're going to do is come in with the opposite sides. Ready? We're going to go in eight seconds for me. Ready? Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one, and let's go. This is day number two. So this is your standing abs workout. We've got another standing abs workout on day number four for you and day number six. And then we're going to do a really big cardio one on day number seven. But again, it'll all be nice and low impact. There'll be no jumping around. That's it. Well done. If you want to repeat day two, just push the repeat button and go around it as many times as you want. Three, two, one, and rest it off. Okay, so we're going to do the knee strikes, two pumps, so, okay? So it's going to be one, two, swap sides, one, two, okay? Ready? We're going to go in eight seconds. Ready? Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one, and let's go. One, two, swap them sides. One, two, swap those sides. One, two, swap those sides. One, two, set. One, two, one, two. Just go slow. You don't have to go at my speed. I'll slow down a little bit for you so that you can see it. Keep going. 15 seconds. Come on, we got this. Let's finish this off. And again. And again, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. Right, grab your dumbbells. If you don't have any, do not worry. You can do this without dumbbells as well. So it's gonna be opposite knee, opposite hook. So it should look like that. Ready? Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one, and go. That's it, well done. Keep going. Twist that core. That's it. Keep going. We've got 20 seconds left on this side, and then we're going to go off on the other side. That's it. Keep going. Come on. We've got this. Well done. Five seconds for me. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest it off. So we're going to do the same thing, other side. Okay, so opposite knee, opposite hook. Okay, so it should look like, just like that, okay? Take your time with it, okay, if you need to. Ready? Here we go, in five, 
four, three, two, one, and let's go. Let's just blast this out. Come on, day two's nearly done. If you feel like you wanna go around this thing again, just push the replay button. If you wanna do the whole seven days, again, challenge yourself. Grab yourself a heavier dumbbell next time. See if you can go around it again. That's it, well done. Five seconds, ready? Five, four, come on, three, two, one, and just rest it off, okay? So we're going for those side lifts, okay? So, hands are on your temple, and then all we're gonna do is gonna come down as far as you can go, and all the way back up again, okay? Ready, here we go, in eight seconds, ready? Five, four, we've nearly done this. Three, two, one, and let's go, blast it, let's go. Well done. That's it. Just keep going. Well done. We've got this. Let's just finish this thing off. That's it. Well done. Keep going. We've got one more to do after this, and then we're done. That's it. Keep going. Five more seconds for me. Three, two, one, and rest it off. Okay, so we're gonna go for the other side now. Remember, same thing. One hand up on that temple. Just gonna come down as far as you can go, and then all the way back up as well. Okay, so it's gonna hit the obliques as well for you. Ready? Here we go. In, three, a two, a one, and let's go. Well done. Just keep going. That's it. Last 20 seconds for me. Come on, we've got this. Day number two is in the books. Remember, if you want to repeat the seven days after it's up, do the seven days again. See if you can improve. This will just help you improve every day. Challenge yourself each day. Get a heavier dumbbell. Three. Two, one, and rest it off. Okay, and there you go. You have just done day number two, which was your standing abs. Okay, so tomorrow will be your back and your biceps. Again, everything's going to be standing up. So there's going to be no sitting on the floor, no jumping around. Okay, so remember, if you want to challenge yourself after you've done the seven days, go back to day number one, grab yourself a heavier dumbbell and see if you can go around it again. If you wanna repeat the videos more than once, just push the replay button and repeat it again for me. Do it as many times as you can in a day. Just put it in the comment section underneath how many times you've done it and just let me know because that'd be really good to hear from you at the same time. So I will see you guys tomorrow for day number three.